हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू दी स्टैट प्रो बेसिक टू एडवांस फुल कोर्स ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज लेट्स स्टार्ट टुडे वे क्रिएट ए मॉडल ऑफ मल्टी स्टोरी बिल्डिंग विथ स्टेयर केस जनरली वी डिज़ाइन और एनालिसिस ऑफ ए स्टेयर केस सेपरेटली बट टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी क्रिएट ए मल्टी स्टोरी बिल्डिंग विथ स्टेयर केस I have a plan of a building. This is the plan, AutoCAD drawing, and this is the staircase. This is the staircase. Now, what we do? We create model of a multi-story building by the help of this plan. We have two option. One option is that we create model by the Uh, uh, this map one by one by one beam or the second option we import this model cad file into the stat pro so first we create model by the gui graphic user interface step by step and after create the model uh, we again create model by the importing cad file into the stat pro let's start this is stat pro vti new project space structure day 3 day 3 meter units in length and force in kilonewton next add beam finish first uh, of all what we do when uh, when i create a, a, any model i create a joint at origin click and close the grid and then select the uh, node cursor and select the nodes by the node cursor now we check this uh, this is the node we create and select and now what we do we create a beam of 500 5.5 meter okay we create a beam of 5.5 meter in x direction so we go to the translate repeat tool in x direction 5.5 meter one step link okay next what we do we create this beam 1.8 meter after that we create 2 meter beam then 3.6 meter then 1.5 meter then we translate this beam in this direction this is the x and this is the z so let's start uh, 1.8 in z direction 1.8 meter link okay then 1.8 then we select this uh, beam and translate into x direction 2.5 select this beam by beam cursor translate to x direction 2.5 meter link okay okay go to the top view this is the views uh, in, in this cube the front view front face is yellow this is front view this is back left right top bottom and isometric view when we when you when we create the plan is good for good if you now select the top view top view okay okay after this uh, we create uh, a 2 meter beam here and one beam more 3.6 and 1.5 okay so we select the nodes and translate repeat tool in z direction three step one step we change the step spacing from here 2 meter second is 3.6 meter and third is 1.5 meter link okay this is okay then we select these two beam and 3.7 meter in x direction these two beam and 3 point x direction sorry 3.7 link okay after this what we do we create 
from this joint to this joint a beam 2.5 meter then translate this beam into 1.8 meter by node cursor select this node translate p to z direction how much 2.1 meter link ok select this beam translate in minus x direction this is minus x direction this spacing is also in minus 2.1 this is 2.1 Okay, 2.1. Sorry, sorry, sorry. 1.89 is width and 2.9 is length. Mm, first, we check measure the length from here. This is 2.1. Okay. Select translate in minus x direction 1.8 minus put in the uh, spacing in opposite for opposite direction. Done. How to remove this measurement by this icon? Okay after that to 3 meter this joint is 3 meter in this direction as that direction this done. then again 3 meter and 1.8 meter again 3 meter and this translate in minus x minus 1.8 meter done the plan is done now you think one question arise what is this this is the steps or symbol that showing here here is the staircase but when we create model in the stat pro we don't require to uh, mark this lines okay Ma uh, now our model plan is is ready then top view you check if you want to measurement go to the this icon and display close this is the measurement if you want to remove this dimensions click here and close, no, click on the remove and remove ok this is the one option save this m1 model now what we do we import this model by AutoCAD directly this is easy method create go to new day 3.1 ok now what we do first of all we remove the all measurement we don't require this measurement in this stat pro and also this steps done now what we do save as this file day 3 uh, model 1 as a AutoCAD format and again save same folder the other format DXF format this is the format the stat pro accept and save and close the AutoCAD now go to the file menu in the stat pro and go to the import select here 3d dxf format import now we select the folder which folder i don't remember ok day 3 this is the file we save autocad format import this is the plan so for elevation we choose y you need to when we um, draw the plan in the AutoCAD that that time the unit is mm so that's why we select mm this is the model some dimensions are come we delete this extra lines come from the AutoCAD we can delete this
this is the plan check the dimensions this is the 6 meter 5.10 meter okay this is the 2.1 and this is the this is 2.1 this is 3 meter so dimension is correct some errors come when we import the stat pro autocad file some errors come first of all we remove this error here you check if you press shift plus k visible or joints here you see some extra joints appear first we merge this joint like this first you select the all structure like this this is uh, the uh, here you see the many joints but when you click on the beam the whole beam is select this is the error because why this joints you, um, for remove this error you select whole structure go to the geometry and select intersect member intersect it means when two member intersect and uh, there is no joint he create automatically joint five members now you select this okay now we delete this extra joint okay all joints are deleted now second uh, first error is removed second is check the duplicate members sometime uh, this is not a single member is overlap too many members uh, when we import from autocad file so first we check select the all beam go to the tool menu check duplicate members no duplicate members select node cursor select all nodes and check the duplicate nodes no duplicate member is done now what we do uh, you know when i create a model in stat pro we starting from the origin okay so first we check this model is also at origin this is we uh, on grid but grid is elevation mode we edit the grid and go to the plan mode now you see our plan is start from here but origin is here so what we do we move this node to here so how take the node cursor and double click on the node this is the node coordinate and go to the geometry here is option move to joint now you put this coordinates this coordinates put here this option is move this joint to the here x is 1.8211 and z is minus 1.824 okay done some error is happen because we don't select the whole structure the structure and go to the geometry and again origin 1.811 minus 1.824 okay the, now structure all error is removed and as well as uh, structure at origin now our, our plan is complete now start to create a multi story building with staircase okay we select the plan go to the translate tool Y is like the Y direction. Six story. Each story has three meter spacing. Select six step, three meter link, and OK. Base beam delete, and provide here support. Go to the general and support. Create support. Fix support. Click on fix support. Go to the front view, and drag the all joints. You here see the all the joints selected. Then assign. OK. Now what we do? Go to the top view and select only the portion where you want to stair case create. So go to the top view and select this is the its staircase area. Select this area and right click on the screen. Go to the new view. New view. And now we we have only staircase. Portion. 
also what we do we also remove this beam not remove only hide we select whole whole portion uh, except uh, this uh, column and right click and again go to the new view okay now uh, we have to draw a stair case here how this is the um, landing and this is the flight like this okay so what we do go to the elevation this is 3 meter and we create a dog like stair it means 1.5 meter every la landing at 1.5 meter okay so what we do by arrow you rotate uh, mm, this okay this uh, distance is 3 meters and this distance is point 1.8 meter it means we provide uh, 500 mm or 500 mm or we can say we provide landing width is 0.7 meter okay so what we do we select this and this sorry select this and copy control C and paste how much in Z direction minus Z direction 0.7 what we do this is the minus z direction what i want i want draw a beam also here that's why what to do okay now we click here copy control c and control v paste and in positive z 0.7 this is the landing width we decide okay now what you do you create a joint at the center of the this beam select the beams and right click insert node and click on the add midpoint ok ok now what you do you select this this portion and copy and paste below 1.5 meter in y direction what we do we make every 1.5 meter a landing like this and again paste uh, here we, I want to here to 1.5 meter positive above again paste here 4.5 meter again paste 6 7.5 meter again paste 3 plus 3 sorry sorry 7.5 plus 9 10.5 10.5 again paste 10.5 it means uh, 13 meter finish control z Control Y say undo. Control Z, Control V. I think thirteen point five. Okay, done. Now what we do? We take a slab. Okay. Also we create at base. Also we have to create this span head base. Copy paste minus one point five. Okay, done. Now you see very carefully why we make this portion as here. This is the plate slab, and this is the landing, and this is the stair. Okay, what we do here is ground, we go up here and we rest here then we go up like this go up here here and here and this is the landing from here we go to by here 
we up here and go to like this like this okay and then then again we go from here to okay one problem here here is not horizontal beams so what we do we select this and copy and paste 1.5 meter done okay again take plate okay from here we go to here and here also a landing plate from here also a landing plate and from here we go to here here also a landing plate from here also here oh, we have to make this beams okay again we take plate cursor and we go here from here and also make the landing here okay then again we go here to here like a stair okay again we have to copy this beam control c copy control v and y 1.5 meter above okay take plate again here here and here also make landing plate here there is many extra beams and joint we delete after this we go up here and here make plate here and here again copy this and make plate and landing plate also create and by here we go to here create landing plate and again copy this 1.5 and make plate now we reach at the terrace if you go to the render view check any error by imaginary walk through the stair and then you understand the you go from here 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 and here and here and here okay uh, all right okay stair is stair is correct now what we do we delete extra this beam is extra this beam also extra this beam also extra this beam also this beam also extra this beam also extra this beam also extra and this beam also extra this beam also extra we delete all extra beams now again check to the render view this is the render view now go to the whole structure view this is the whole building again render view of the whole building okay look nice okay one more error here also we have to make a slab but i am talking about the terrace here here but here is also a concrete uh, slab that's why i don't make the girder if uh, we have to create go to the plate go to the whole structure by this icon now again check the render view okay done this is the staircase with multi story building generally we design a staircase separately but in this video i teach you how to make a staircase with multi story building in this video only modeling the next part we have to apply load and analysis we also apply the properties go to the properties and define a rectangle we take uh, 
थ्री हंड्रेड डेप्थ बाई टू फिफ्टी विथ वे एज्यूम असाइन टू ऑल वी नो दैट बिफोर वी असाइन द प्रॉपर्टी फर्स्ट वी कैलकुलेट द वट इज़ द डेप्थ ऑफ द कॉलम क्रॉस सेक्शन ऑफ द कॉलम एंड वट इज़ द डेप्थ ऑफ द बीम ईच बीम हैव डिफरेंट डेप्थ पॉसिबली यू मे बी ईच बीम हैव डिफरेंट डेप्थ और क्रॉस सेक्शन बट टूडे वी ओनली लर्न हाउ टू क्रिएट ए मॉडलिंग ऑफ स्टेर मल्टी स्टोरी बिल्डिंग विथ स्टेयर केस दैट्स वाई वी एज्यूम ए क्रॉस सेक्शन वी अप्लाई फॉर ओनली चेक इन द रेंडर व्यू दिस इज द रेंडर व्यू we check because this this is the extra beam this is the extra beam that's why we check only okay so this is the video uh, here we learn how to create a multi story building by autocad or by manually and with staircase this is the dogleg square we we also create circular square and other uh, stair uh, by this method If you like this video please subscribe like and share and click on bell icon bell icon because if you know the stat pro the next series after the stat pro is e tab then abacus ansys revit so many software series is coming soon that's why you uh, if you uh, subscribe and click on bell icon you get the future videos thank you